Hey everybody, Marion the Barbarian here. We got another great shave for you today. Obviously, we're gonna be using Murphy and McNeil. And I think today is Mandate of Heaven. We're gonna strip down the clothes real quick. And we're gonna put up the Aeon base ingredients. Awesome base in my opinion. Duck tallow, beef tallow. And then we're gonna follow it up with the scent notes. And honestly, when I looked at the scent notes, I can't remember everything right now, but I looked up the scent notes before I even smelled it. And I thought, wow. This is going to be kind of uh, dark, you know? That's what I was thinking. It's not dark at all. It's kind of a fresh, woody scent. Um, woodsy, woody, however you want to say it. It was really nice. I whipped it up with the... Uh, it, it's kind of like a clean, fresh, woodsy underlying scent. I think there was incense and stuff in there. I can't remember the other notes, but just a lot of things that I didn't think all together would smell like this. And it smells pretty freaking good, guys, if you ask me. But anyways, we use the Samogue and the Captain's Choice. Um, second use. I'm trying to see how it goes. Really nice scent, guys. Like this one, I highly recommend. I will let you know, the meetup is still what I want to do. Um, the place I wanted to do it isn't available May 18th, but they are available May 11th, which is the Saturday before the Saturday I wanted to do it, which is feasible for me. Um, they don't normally do things like that and like normally venue price and I'm like, it's a brewery, guys. My thing is, it's like there's going to be 50 to 100 people. If people want to eat and drink, they will pay for their own stuff. If I didn't tell you and we just showed up with 50 to 100 people and you didn't have enough people to serve us, you know what I'm saying? It's no different. I don't know. Because, like, I can show up at a Logan's Roadhouse and they'll give us the whole back room and not charge us anything, you know? And we can sit there for hours and buy drinks and food. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. Everything's still up in the air. It's kind of frustrating. But all right, <clears throat> we are using the bison. I like the bison. Came back first use since I got it back from uh, Matt Fox. First time using the uh, Gillette 7 o'clock yellows. I haven't used a lot of 7 o'clocks. There we go. Wanted something super mild. Um, irritation. It's pert near gone. Um, which is a very good thing. Still been daily shaving, just making sure I pay attention to technique and using proper skin care afterwards. I was able to maintain daily shaves and get my face healed up. It's nice to get the bison back. I'm happy to have it. It's a good looking razor. It's smoother than the Overlander, but it is not as efficient. And I do feel like this is um, smoother than the Overlander. Daily Shave Soap. This is a nice scent. Like it's a fresh, clean, woodsy scent. I'd almost want to say, sh but not like shower gel, like contemporary shower gel, but kind of a soapy scent. Um, it's woodsy as well. It's fresh. It's nice. Like you can wear it anytime. Um, Mandate of Heaven is not a Celtic symbol. I read the thing on it. Don't get me to lie and y'all can go look it up on the link I listed below if you're interested. But it's a Chinese symbol. Um, 
gave the emperor um, permission, power from God, something like that, to be emperor. Let's put it that way. That's all I know. That's all I know. What do you think, guys? I want to do a meetup so bad. But if it's going to cost me hundreds of dollars, I don't know that I can do the meetup, you know? Don't have money like that. It's kind of why, like, I don't, I want it to be a hobbyist meetup and not artisan with, like, all the tables and stuff because, like, I'm paying. <laughs> and I'm not making anything. So I don't get it. I don't know, man. We'll see how it goes. Because, I mean, I don't know if y'all saw David Gonzalez do his video. People think we make money doing these videos. No one has ever paid me. And this year is the most I've ever gotten free stuff. I've never had anybody send me a free razor. Not a manufacturer. Hell, even my TRC razor I paid for. Um, like, yeah. Like, not even a vendor has sent me a free razor to use on my channel. So, I might get a free soap, might get free samples, which is fine. And I'm not saying people need to, because I do my channel the way I like to. Um, and I appreciate the people who send me stuff that aren't artisans and things like, Hey, I like this. Try it out. Oh, you've never used this? Well, I got a sample of that. I've got this. I got that. Let me send it to you. And that, that's a more fun way to do it because I get to interact with people. And not just the artisans. I've really been surprised how close this has been on my chin. Because I'm not buffing and going over it multiple times. I did there probably more than I should. But I don't make any kind of money doing this. Um, I do get affiliate money now. Just because thank you people that use my affiliate codes. And it helps me buy new products I use on the channel. And a lot of stuff that I don't end up liking or enjoying. I turn around and give away on the channel. Just making sure we get that neckline right there where I have a hard time getting it close. Upper lip. Strictly kind of with the grain and a little tilted. Like, y'all see a little bit of redness still here, but it's not sensitive anymore. So that's a good thing. That's a change. We are going to get close in the areas that I know there's no irritation. All right, that's it, guys. We're going to rinse up. We'll be right back. All right, guys, we are back. So Patrick pointed out, I used to point it out on all the times I've used horse hair, but I didn't the last two. So shame on me. <coughs> horse hair is the one that you need to uh, comb out. You see the wide comb side? I use that. Kind of go about halfway in. Just rotate. You have to brush it out. It will knot up. You'll get the... Uh, you know, hole of death or whatever it is in the middle. And you just have to, every time. And, like, dude, you can move faster than I'm moving on video, but you don't want to tug. You just want to be gentle. Then if you really want, you can go to the fine tooth, but there's no need for it. You're just trying to untangle it, and you're done. I'm going to use this for a while, guys. Like, you're going to see these for quite a few shaves. 
and I just kind of want to see is 50 versus $17.99. This doesn't stink like this one did out the gate. Um, this is a lot softer as in like, just, I don't know, this is more springy. We'll see. Different size knots completely, like this is 27 and a half, I think. This is uh, 21. But I just want to know, is it worth it? You know, what's the deal? I can tell you right now that Samoge's better than the two Vylong I've owned. So, what do you say about that? Where is this? Mandate of Heaven, guys. Like, this one I do recommend. You don't hear me at the end of videos going, oh, dude, that's a great scent. I recommend it. I may say it's a good scent. It's a nice scent. This one's really nice. <laughs> like, I, I really enjoy it. This one will be going on my list of things I need to pick up. And, hey, I got to support Murphy and McNeil if I'm out here telling you guys y'all should be doing it. Um, but, anyways, Carb Bison. We're going to follow it up with some Honeysuckle Ethos because it's just some good stuff. Um, very good skin food. And I'm sorry to gripe a little. Like, I know I rambled, but we, we don't make money, guys. I would just like to do a hobby meetup, meet people. I'm, I'm not going to be able to travel this year at all to any of the meetups as much as I'd like to. So I'd like to have one here. I'll do planning and stuff to have one here um, just so we can meet up. I want to see people. I haven't met people in the hobby face-to-face -face other than Pete Hendricks and Jeremy Tyler, the traveling shaver. Those are the only two people I have met face-to-face -face in this hobby. I would like to meet more. Not that I have an issue with either one of those people. Just saying I would like to meet more people in the hobby. Nashville's a great place for people to come, and like I said, I gotta figure it out. Um, if you've made it this far, you know, thumbs up, noty bell, all that good stuff. Wristwatch check. There's the citizen. Love this thing. Suyosa, I think it is. Have I forgotten anything, guys? I feel like I'm forgetting something. If I did, I'm sorry. If I rambled and forgot something, I do apologize. This one is on the fourteen twenty-five, and I think the splash is like sixteen ninety-nine or something like that. But the whole point is, guys, for like thirty less than thirty-one dollars, you get a set, you know, soap and splash. Really nice. All right, I've rambled on long enough. Hope y'all have a wonderful day. We'll catch you again tomorrow because we're gonna do another shave, daily shaves. Get the kids this weekend, and like I said, we'll catch you guys next shave.